Wake up, wake up, the weekend is here and it is time to celebrate your breakfast lifestyle with your friends here at the Snack Society. Good morning, folks. How are you doing? It's your boy, Heel Will Mahoney, here with Brandon. What's going on, Snacker Stars? And we are on the road this morning because I have heard the call on the radio. I have seen the advertisements and we had to make a trip. We had to make a trip to the land of the chicken, the chick. Filet, uh oh! If you will, I haven't had Chick Fil A breakfast in years. Same here, because in our area, Chick Fil A is very hard to get to. It's not convenient. Yeah, I mean, there's like one or two in our general area, and they're all like more than ten miles away. So, yeah, yeah, they're not in a in an area we're normally in. So it had to be a special trip because they have brought something and improved upon it. They are claiming they are claiming to have improved upon the hash brown. Scramble Ooh. bowl. Is that like a six man scramble? Uh, might not be like a six man scramble. Maybe there's six eggs in it or so. Oh, wow. But they got a scramble bowl or a burrito. Oh, is that what this is? That is what you got right there. And that is what I have right here. Awesome. So we are going to see what this is all about because you got the bowl burrito version. I got the bowl. I'm going to pop this top here and right up inside there. Well, let's check that out. A little, ch little chicken come flying out on us. But that is looking solid. That's got scrambled eggs in there. It's got Chick-fil-A chicken, and I guess it's got hash browns in it. Yeah, well, the hash browns came up on the side. Yeah, that, that is the chicken and some cheese, of okay, course. there's some cheese too. Yeah, okay. yeah, that, that has got all kinds of good stuff going on up in there. It smells amazing. Now, your burrito, I'm guessing, is the exact same thing. Just wrapped up in this uh, tortilla, which is an odd sort of translucent tortilla. It almost reminds me of like a <laughs> spring roll or something like that but maybe it's just low quality, I don't know. Yeah, it smells amazing. The mm -hmm. price point on this I'm all about. For the meal version with the coffee and your little uh, pie box of hash browns here, mm -hmm. for the whole thing, uh, $5.99. Not bad. For either one of them. Not bad. Not bad at all, I'm thinking. And then if you go solo on it, I think they're doing the scramble for, if I check the, the phone here, it is going like uh, $3.49. Okay, not too bad. It'd be bad. saying if you go on the solo version. Um, liking the size of that, and it smells amazing. Pretty decently sized uh, burrito there compared to my forearm, and of course next to my noggin, the way <laughs> I always do it. There you go. So I'm going to take a bite right up here and see, because I, I got some chicken, I got some eggs. We got all kinds of stuff here on the Breakfast Lifestyle, so I'm going to take a little taste oh. and see what we got. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's got hash brown in there. Yeah, my, mine are, I was saying, mine are buried in the bottom. Yep. Now, yeah. they're, they're, they're underneath all the, the egg and chicken goodness. The disbursement looks pretty interesting in the burrito there, if you want to see that without being disgusted. Mm -hmm. And lots of egg. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't think I've gotten to the chicken yet, so let me take another bite. I got to the chicken right away, since in mine, the chicken is right here up on top. But yeah, nice, big, tasty looking pieces of chicken up in here. Uh, obviously, it's Chick-fil-A. You know the chicken is going to be the bomb. That's their main event. Now, uh, normally we have uh, Miss Cholula mm -hmm. on the road with us with the Snack Society in the morning. Today, we got her her husband or her boyfriend, Texas Pete. That's right. Mm. He lives over the border. She lives under the border or <laughs> south of the border. South of the border. And uh, they got together oh. and they got hot sauce. Oh. I wonder what both would taste mixed up. We'll get that up in here. They also had some thrown in the bag here. Um, jalapeno salsa. Interesting. Up in there. So, but I'm going to have the Texas Pete up here in the mix to start. And see what that adds to the equation. But uh, so far, Chick-fil-A, I got, I got nothing to complain about here. Mmm. Oh, yeah. That sweet Texas Pete. Mmm. Yeah, not overly hot. Not enough spice in there. Just to add a little bit of kick to that burrito, because mm -hmm. you know every burrito needs a little kick. Oh yeah, and then every a breakfast bowl like this with some eggs in it and some chicken, it needs a little kick too. Now I'm awake. Yeah, this was worth the drive. Yeah, um, I got nothing bad to say about it. Obviously, it's Chick Fil A. The chicken's awesome. The eggs are good, and there's a good portion of them. Hash browns underneath is a nice little surprise down here on the bottom of that bowl. Um. For me, this is easy. This is a full thumbs up. I'm digging it. I like mm. it a lot. There's tons of eggs in there. 
Mm. Because it's the burrito version, the hash browns are getting a little bit more moist, a little bit more quickly, mm. I'm sure. Um, mm. and I don't have a ton of chicken in mind, so it's hard to judge all that in one bite without digging it apart and reorganizing mm. it. Chicken. But it does taste really, really good. Mm. It's Chick-fil-A's chicken, which is among the best out there in the fast food world. Mm. Uh, you know, other than that, put all those flavors together. They work, even if the chicken is basically an egg's mother. But <laughs> whatever, man. Put it together and have a happy family. I'm giving it a 7 eighths. Oh, near perfect on the burrito version, the bowl. I'm giving the full thumbs up now in case we're on there. It's a nice size. That's a, that's a good handful. Yeah. It's a nice deep, and for that price point, can't beat it. I have not tried the coffee yet. I don't believe I've ever had the Chick-fil-A coffee. So real quick, a little tasty taste. Oh, that works too. Yeah, it's got good coffee that's not over like brood or anything like that, mm -hmm. so it's fine. No, this was a good experience all around. This was worth the trip for us to bring you Chick-fil-A home style breakfast bowls on the Breakfast Lifestyle this morning. What do you think since they are rolling this out? Let us know in the comments down below or do it where it all got started on the Facebook group. That's right. Join the Facebook group by clicking on the link down below and you can find out if you're in the running to become Snacker Star of the Month. The top, the top 10 has been released for December. Will you be in the top 10 for January? Find out January 1st. <laughs> Also, check us out on social media, at, uh, like Twitter and Instagram at Brandon Reich SAS and at Hugh Mahoney, who is the host. Yes, indeed. And when you do that, it's really simple what you need to do. Two things to make everything happen. Hashtag Breakfast Lifestyle when you're celebrating the Breakfast Lifestyle. And hashtag Snack Society all day, every day for all your snacking needs. We're taking this show on the road because Chick-fil-A did this right. And we had to let you know when you let, let, get in on this action. You join that Four Horsemen YouTube, baby. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Mm. In the meantime, in, in between, between time. time. <laughs> we'll see you next time and rise and shine. Bye-bye.